Greetings guys and gals, my name is Thad and welcome back to our Dragon Age Origins melee only playthrough. The last part was a very grim part, the forces are defeated and the Darkspawn has... Oh, saved my game. <laughs> the Darkspawn has killed not only King Kalen but also the last Grey Warden, well besides you, you know me and Alistair and Jens, yes Jens you're a Grey Warden too. Oh hey, he works his tail happily. Pet Jens. He rolls around happily on his back. <laughs> you're a good boy, you're a good boy. Yes, he's a Grey Warden as well. Anyway, so we are the last Grey Wardens remaining and now we need to gather uh, the forces to, you know, the, the forces of good <laughs> to uh, defeat the Darkspawn. But first of all, let's level up Alistair, my, my guy. We are going to level up his constitution and one power in dexterity. Yep, that's where we go. And we are going to let him master combat. Um, Alright, so we can't do that. Shield balance. Yep. Gonna give him all the shield skills. Alright, let's move on. Out of the Kokari Wilds. Because, you know, Flemeth and... <laughs> Flemeth has basically saved us. And we are going to take her daughter Morrigan with us. But, you know, <laughs> now that I'm talking about it... Speak. Morrigan, my girl. My girl, the one and only. I really like her. Like... I love playing with her, but the problem is that this is a melee only run, so we cannot let her use any spells, which I, I, I won't say it makes her useless, right, but it basically makes her useless, <laughs> so we won't take her with us, I'm sorry. Like I really love the, girl, love the gal, but you know, alright, so clear all of her actions, now save it, and there we go. So now she won't use any spells. Oh yeah, we, on, we also have to take away your staff. <laughs> Aww. I'm sorry, Morrigan. I really am. Alright, let's move on to Lothering. A small town just off the Imperial Highway at the edge of the Hinterlands. The Hinterlands? Where, did I, where have I heard that? Oh right, the Alchemist of the Hinterlands. It was a sketch in... Never mind. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. It was in... Not the office, but Parks and Recreation. Here we are. Oh, cinematic. So I'll shut up. Denarim. Oh, it's low gain. And I expect each of you to supply these men. We must rebuild what was lost at Ostagar and quickly. There are those who would take advantage of our weakened state if we let them. We must defeat this darkspawn incursion, but we must do so sensibly and without hesitation. Your Lordship. If I might speak. You have declared yourself Queen Anora's regent and claim we must unite under your banner for our own good. But what of the army lost at Ostagar? Your withdrawal was most fortuitous. Yes, I agree. If you can't remember, I'll explain in a second. Everything I have done has been to secure Ferelden's independence. I have not shirked my duty to the throne, and neither will any of you. The Bannon will not bow to you simply because you demand it. Understand this. I will brook no threat to this nation from you or anyone. I really don't like this guy. <laughs> Bantegan, please! Your Majesty, your father risks civil war. Indeed. If Eamon were here... Bantegan, my father is doing what is best. Did he also do what was best for your husband, your Majesty? Oof. <laughs> Burn. <laughs> Wait, so what, what, what titles are there? There's this weird band ta title, then there is Al, then there is Tan, yeah, and then there's Lord, right? I don't Wake know. up, gentlemen. More travelers to attend to. I'd guess the pretty one is the leader. Uh, they don't look much like their mothers, you know. Uh, maybe we should just let these ones pass. Nonsense. Greetings, travelers. Greetings. Highwaymen, preying on those fleeing the Darkspawn, I suppose. They are fools to get in our way. Sons I of say, bitches. Teach them a lesson. Now is that any way to greet someone? A simple ten silvers and you're free to move on. 
You know, Morgan, I'm actually with you on that one. <laughs> Very well, here's ten silver. No, you should listen to your friend. We are not refugees. What did I tell you? No wagons, and this one looks armed. The yeah, well, I got everyone, a sword on my back. That's why it's a toll, <laughs> and not, say, a refugee tax. Oh, right. Even if you're no refugee, you still got to pay. All right, so you and Shrek here better freak off, or I bash your head in. How about that? <laughs> forget that, I'm not paying. Uh, yeah, forget it. Well, I can't say I'm pleased to hear that. We have rules, you know. You want to fight? Right. Want to go? Get to ransack huh? your corpse, then. Those are the rules. Big words. You really want to fight a great one? You can certainly try. <laughs> well, this is going nowhere. Let's finish this, gents. <laughs> it's gonna be your funeral, my guy. All right, kill the leader first. Morrigan, I'm gonna equip you with a uh, melee weapon for now, but yeah, there's no there's no way I can keep you in my party. I'm sorry, Morrigan. Ooh, it's actually a big axe. Coming. All right, like I said, kill the leader. <laughs> kill him first. <laughs> I'm actually going to use a health poultress here. Just to be just to be completely sure. Alright, looking good. Shop is right. We surrender. <laughs> oh cool, we actually we're, we're only have to kill him. Or defeat him. Get us all. We didn't kill him. Get by, you're a criminal. Yeah, you take money off of refugees. What's wrong with you, man? Yes, I'm a criminal. I yes. <laughs> I apologize. You apologize? Well, I'm turning you into the authorities. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Yeah. You, you follow my lead. I could use some soldiers. No. There aren't any. Just the Templars, and, and they'll execute me. Well, <laughs> they'll do what they must. Come with me. Well, is executing really the right punishment for you? I mean, yes, you stole some stuff. I mean, you destroyed lives, basically, right? So, and you and you didn't hesitate. You wanted to kill me for my stuff. So, feels kind of, you know, hand over everything you've stolen. Yeah, you know what? Hand it over to me. I give it back to the people. And I hope you didn't kill anyone, because then I'll come for you. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, of course. The coins we collected are right here. Uh, just over a hundred silvers. The rest is in the chest we brought. I swear. All right, then. And start running and don't come back. Bless you. The darkspawn can have this place. Yeah. Wow, one goal. Holy crap. Dead Templar. You killed a Templar? Did you kill him? Ah, damn it. <laughs> oh, we got a lot of... A lot of new codex thingies. All right, a note from Sir Henrik. So many of my fellow knights have been searching for the urn. Surely one of them must have found Brother Gen 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 TV by now. Still, until I hear that all is well, I must proceed as planned. Brother TV holds the key to finding the urn of sacred of sacred ashes. We always knew this, but I believe I know I now know where Brother TV Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> lies. I have been to his home in Denerim and found the trail, and, and and I am amazed that other knights have not done likewise. Unless they have? No, it is best not to get caught up in thoughts of conspiracy. Sir Donald awaits my report in Lothering. I must go to him immediately and report what I have learned. Should anyone find these ramblings, all I ask is that he be informed of my fate. I pray that he complete what I cannot. Alright, Sir Knight, I guess it's on to me to complete whatever your, <laughs> whatever your ramblings were about. Trap and lesser health poultures. Yep, that's kind of nice. So we already get the lesser health poultures back that I just used. Oh. Well, there it is. Lothering. Pretty as a painting. Ah. So you have <laughs> finally blood. decided to rejoin us, have you? Falling on your blade in grief seemed like too much trouble, I take it. Oh, is my on. being upset so hard to understand? Have you never lost someone important to you? Just what would you do if your mother died? <laughs> Before or after I stopped laughing. <laughs> right, very creepy. Forget I asked. Yeah, these two don't go together very well. But Alistair, that's a very weird question. I mean, you know she was brought up in the wild, right? So who could she possibly lose beside her mother? And she doesn't seem that fond of her. So just get to the point. 
What did you want to talk about, Elster? His navel, I suspect. He certainly has been contemplating it for long enough. Morgan. Oh, Morgan, I, I love it. you, but please. This shut is up. the part <laughs> where we're shocked to discover how you've never had a friend your entire life. I can be friendly when I desire to. Alas, desiring to be more intelligent does not make it so. Dudes, we have anyway, better things to I do. I thought we should talk Come about on. where we intend to go first. I figured out. Let's just go on. I need to look for Fergus. All right, my brother. I, I for completely forgot about him. We should try to use these treaties, I assume. We need to hear some news before we can decide. You have some thoughts on that point, Ellis? Yeah, what, what do you want to do? This should be good. I More think again. what Flemeth suggested is the best idea. These treaties, have you looked at them? Yes, I have. There no, are I three main groups that we have treaties for. The Dalish Elves, the Dwarves of Orzammar, and the Circle of Magi. I also still think that Arleman is our best bet for help. We might even want to go to him first. I'll figure it out as we go, and then we need to find these people. What do you think we should do, Morrigan? Go after your enemy directly. Find this man, mm. Loghain, and kill him. The rest of this business with the treaties can then be done in safety. Yes, he certainly wouldn't Sounds see that coming. Sounds good, And but... it's not like he has the advantage of an army and experience and... I was asked for my opinion and I gave it. If your wish is to come up with reasons why something cannot be done, we will stand here until the dark spawn <laughs> are upon us. Yeah, but Morrigan, he kind of has a point. I mean, going directly for Loghain is... It would be possible, but it's very improbable that we can actually do anything to him, right? I mean... Yeah, so kind of a, you know, I'm ready to get going. Uh, I'm ready to get going is approving with Morrigan, right? It's approving what Morrigan said. Why are you leaving up to me? Now we need to find these people. Yeah, we need to find these people. I can give you directions if you like. No, thanks. I think I don't need any more directions. Then you have a plan. Yes, I'm ready to get going. Fair enough. Let's head into the village whenever you're ready. Yep. Alright then. Inventory overload, what? We are already at 80 items, that's crazy. Alright. Need to keep that in mind. Elf fruit. Alright, time to give these people back what these highwaymen stole from them. So can we actually... <gasps> it's a chicken! <laughs> Sorry, I just love chickens. They are, they are like dinosaurs, but, but small and cuddly. Refugee. Please. We came here to get away from the fighting. Oh, oh, yeah, right. I, I mean, I mean, fighting. Who, who, who looks here like fighting? It's not like I'm <laughs> splat up in blood or anything. So let's talk about your mother for a moment. <sighs> I'd rather talk about your mother. <laughs> well, there's nothing to talk about. And besides, isn't your mother a scary witch who lives That's in right, the middle of the forest? This. Much more interesting. Alistair. To you, perhaps, you would find the moss growing upon a stone interesting. You know what's more interesting than that? Chickens? Apostates. Mages outside of the tower. That's illegal, you know. You did not read that in a book somewhere, did you? <laughs> I hope the small letters did not strain you over much. Oof, oof. Oh, we could not talk about your it's mother. my opinion That works for me. <laughs> Alright, there we go. <laughs> Sorry, I just love to listen to their banter. Refugee girl. Who are you? I am Melina. Can you protect us? Um, I mean, I can try. Refugee girl, refugee. So none of these refugees actually talk to me, right? I hear those bandits are back yeah. again. No, no, no. The... Why don't the Templars kill them? What do you need? Oh, sorry, I didn't want to. Got it. Broken crate, gonna take some elf root. Gonna take the stuff we find. Leather armor, gonna take the two, but my inventory is full. So let's see if we can... You know what, let's, let's try to... Uh, find someone who we can actually sell the stuff we have to right so let's just pass these refugees you there huh? if you're looking for safe shelter I'll warn you there's none to be found no no I'm actually looking for someone to sell my stuff to oh look how oh back off I have the right to charge what I wish you profit from their misfortune I should have the Templars give away everything in your carts you wouldn't dare any of you step too close to my goods and I'll... It's so nice to see everyone <laughs> working together in a crisis. Yeah. It warms the heart. Scumbags. Scumbags oh, everywhere. You there. You look able. Would you care to make a tiny profit helping a beleaguered businessman? Beleaguered? What does that mean? I can't figure it out by the context. Whatever. Solve this yourselves. Why would I want... 
Get rid of the tiny pod. Is your profiteering ruffling some feathers? Why would I want to help you? Didn't I mention profit? He is charging outlandish prices for things people desperately need. Yeah. Their blood is filling his pockets. His only survival of the fittest. All of these Cretans would do the same in his shoes, given hmm. the chance. I, I have limited that. supplies. The people decide what those supplies are worth to them. <laughs> you bought most of your wares from these very people last week. Yeah. Now they flee for their lives, and you want to talk business? Look, stranger, I have a hundred silvers if you drive this rabble off, starting with that priest. I'm an honest merchant, nothing more. An honest merchant, nothing more. Yeah, but you're also a scumbag, so I don't I do not stand for your scumbaggery, so I'm not interested. Uh not interested. Well I won't stand for thievery. Especially not at the demand of some shrewish priest. No one steals then from you. Go, man. and may you get all you deserve. I hope the darkspawn choke on your cheap hides. Bah! Bah! I suppose it couldn't <laughs> be helped. Maker, help us all. I'll help you. But, oh, the merchant is gone now. Damn. I actually wanted to... Wait, but he left his chest? That's weird. <laughs> All right, so we have a lot of scumbaggery going on, going on in uh, Lothering. So, yeah, I think we make we make a little cut here, and uh, see you in the next part when we will probably, hopefully, find someone that I can sell all my stuff to. So can I? So I can fill my inventory with, <laughs> with even more stuff. <laughs> um, yeah. So anyway, until the next part. Have a nice day. Have a nice night. And of course, as always, have a nice time.